Hi everyone! Kamusta po kayo? Uh, this is Eden po of the MCI Homes. Uh, let me introduce to you uh, our latest project in uh, Taguig City, inside the Kashi Estates. Uh, this is all the residences. All right, uh, the property po will be composed of uh, four high-rise condominium buildings with 18 floor, um, 18 stories uh, for each building. And uh, we offer two and three bedrooms here. All right, um, okay. Uh, all the residences po will be accessible via uh, C5 Road and just a few minutes away from major CBDs like Makati CBD, BGC, and Ortega Center. Uh, near all the residences or inside Akashi Estates are um, commercial establishments where you can get your uh, basic uh, needs and um, we also help um, the educational institutions and health institutions as well as security and safety near uh, the property. All right, so our clients or most of our clients po na nag-invest uh, sa other residences are established individuals with ages uh, ranges from uh, 35 to 50. And um, uh, most of the reasons why they purchase a unit in Alder is uh, to use it as their primary home, uh, also to um, to um, upgrade or to uh, buy a unit that is bigger in size for their growing family and also uh, for those already renting inside the cash estates who want to have um, a property of their own naman po. Right. So, ang ibang reason ng pag-purchase ng aming clients sa other residences is for rental income. Uh, since all the residences po is located um, near um, commercial business districts, madali po ang magparenta sa property. And uh, also, yung iba namang nag-invest ay para i-resale ang property in the future if, uh, uh, their, if the price already appreciated. Yung iba naman, gusto maging vacation home, uh, lalo na yung mga uh, based abroad or para doon sa mga may uh, mga nakatira sa province pero gusto magkaroon ng ng bahay na magitirahan dito sa Metro Manila. Alright, so why invest in other residences? Uh, these are the four main reasons for those clients who invested in other residences. Um, they wanted a bigger unit space. Uh, they like the exclusivity of the area. Uh, they believe in the quality um, of uh, the MCI um, developments. And also, they want to um, get the value for their hard-earned money. Alright, so for a bigger unit size, um, the MCI Homes uh, standard uh, two-bedroom unit is has an area of 56 square meters. Uh, while in all the residences, po, uh, the average unit size is uh, 68 square meters for a two-bedroom unit. Alright, so for exclusivity, all the residences will be located inside Akashi Estates. It is a private a township developed and maintained by a DMCI Homes. And uh, the entire property po is guarded. Alright, so uh, for the value of, uh, for the client's uh, value, um, mm -hmm. for the value of your money or for the client's, um, uh, for the value of the client's hard-earned money, uh, they can get a uh, bigger unit size with the lower uh, price per square meter as compared to other um, competitors uh, in the area. Uh, but they are still getting the premium amenities and features that they deserve such as uh, the swimming pools, basketball court, uh, children's play area, linear park, picnic area, entertainment more, uh, inter entertainment room, co-working space, and a lot more. 
All right. So uh, for the quality, uh, the MCI Homes is um, the country's first quadruple A contractor. When you say quadruple A con contractor, uh, they can compete with other international um, developers or contractors um, with um, with uh, construction or with um, developments that uh, pass the uh, global standard. All right, uh, the MCI Homes is also. Um, is uh, also the the or introduces a uh, lumivent technology uh, this is a design that allows uh, cross ventilation and natural light to pass through uh, meaning um uh, yung yung natural na may merong merong natural na ventilation na pumapasok sa loob ng building um pati yung natural light so um makaka-save kayo ng um, ng electricity kasi dahil dun sa sa uh, opening na inaalat ng DMCI uh, actually it is uh, uh, three two bedroom uh, units na ginawang open ng DMCI para lang mak makapasok ang ang natural light and air sa loob ng building so masasabi natin na yung building ng DMCI homes ay literal na makakatinang hindi siya enclosed space na pag nandun kayo sa loob ng building saradong sarado kayo unless buksan nyo yung mga windows no? and uh, uh, yung windows para may makapasok na natural na hangin. Pero sa DMCI homes, yung mismong building merong opening for the natural uh, ventilation and light to uh, permit inside the building. So, um, ang living condition um, ang living condition ng unit owners or tenants ay healthy all right so um aside from that um the MCI homes um also make make may um the MCI homes uh, make sure that the um it is not only uh, located in uh, a single space or a single area of the building but um, you can uh, find these openings every uh, five floors of the entire building and uh, it is located at the uh, front side and uh, back area of the, the property or the building all right so uh, the location of uh, all the residences is um, and uh, is composed of uh, established uh, communities. So um, Akasha Estates is uh, composed of uh, different DMCA homes properties, and it is uh, maintained and well guarded. Right. So um, all the residences is located or will be located uh, in, a, in about a uh, five minute walk to Akasha, uh, Akasha Town Center. So um, once everything is back to normal, uh, it will be easier for you and your family to um, to uh, go around the area or to um, uh, enjoy uh, the, the commercial areas that are located within Akasha Estates. Right. So, um, other residences will have an uh, additional entry and uh, exit point. Aside from uh, the main entrance, which is located uh, in Cayetano Boulevard, uh, for, formerly known as uh, Levi Mariano Avenue, uh, the, the other entry or and exit point ay makikita po sa may um, ML Quezon Avenue. So, it will be easier for you to uh, go to Bikutan or to a uh, Pasig and Tipolo area using this uh, additional entry and exit point. Right. So, um, ang other residences po ay, um, ay itatayo sa uh, 28,607 square uh, meter area and uh, it will be composed of uh, four 18-story uh, high-rise building, uh, high-rise uh, condominium buildings with uh, 17 to 18 residential levels and uh, will be composed of 1,515 units. 
Um, magkakaroon din po ng dalawang basement parking levels with 1,217 parking uh, slots uh, all in all. It will also have one amenity level with 80% parking ratio. Right? And, alright, so Alda Residence says has a modern uh, artisanal theme. Okay, so uh, this is uh, the site development plan of Alda Residences. Uh, the first um, building will be composed of uh, 348 units. Uh, that is Andrea Building. The second building is uh, Manzuria and it will have uh, 377 units. Uh, the third building uh, is Oregon will with uh, 413 units and the last build, building um, will have uh, 377 units and that is a Sylvan building. All right, so here is the site development plan of uh, the entire property. Uh, we have the entrance gate and guard house, the drop-off area, the entrance to basement parking, the landscape garden, the lap pool, the leisure pool, the kiddie pool, the lawn area, the play area, the picnic area, the play court, and the linear park. Okay, so uh, this is the gate and uh, guarded entrance of all the residences. This will be the drop-off area. And uh, this is uh, the landscape garden. Uh, this is the lap pool. This is the leisure pool. This will be uh, the kiddie pool. Uh, this is the play area. The picnic area. Basketball court. The linear park. Uh, the amenity core. And uh, this is Andeya's uh, building facade. This is the first building in all the residences. Right? So uh, here is uh, the property's uh, sky patio. This is what we call, um, the opening here is uh, what we call the Lumibent Design Technology of PNCI Homes. Nag-alat po siya ng tatlong dapat na two-bedroom units. Ginawa niya pong open area para dun sa natural light and air to pass through. To pass through. So, makikita po yan sa every, um, after five floors ng building. At uh, meron din po yan sa uh, back area ng mismo uh, building. So, uh, meron siya sa front and back area of the building para maging well ventilated at ma may natural uh, light na makapasok po sa loob ng building. Alright? So, uh, this is the roof deck of the property. Uh, makikita nyo po yung uh, iba't ibang views sa, ng Metro Manila uh, and uh, the neighboring um, province that is uh, Laguna de Baipo. Alright, so for the north view, makikita nyo po dito yung Mahati and BGC skyline. Uh, sa east view ay ang antipolo view naman po, antipolo area. At ang Laguna de Bay ay yung nasa south uh, view naman po ng property. Alright, so um, okay, this is the reception um, lobby of uh, Andaya building. This is the bar area. This is the game area. Uh, this is the lounge area. This is the elevator lobby. And uh, these are um, other indoor amenities such as uh, fitness gym, entertainment room, and the snack bar. 
Right. So um, this is the co-working space, an additional uh, feature in all the residences. Um, tamang tama po ito sa current situation dahil um, marami sa atin ang working or working from home and uh, having their online classes. So um, very uh, timely po ang pagkakaroon ng ganito sa property dahil kahit nga sa uh, loob ka ng iyong uh, na, nasa loob ka ng iyong bahay or nasa loob na doon ka sa iyong pinitirhan ay meron pang area para makapagtrabaho ng convenient ng maayos at uh, maka-attend maka sa iyong online class conveniently. So, malaking bagay po ito sa mga unit owners and tenants pagka uh, uh, turned over na po ang property. Alright, so um, aside from that, we also have the convenience store, the fired operated laundry, and the water station for ag again for the convenience of the unit owners and tenants. Alright, so um, in other residences, we also offer uh, improved unit features like uh, bigger windows for uh, additional for uh, more uh, ventilated area and or for more ventilation. And also, um, we also have a provision for split type air conditioning unit, and the sizes are uh, the and the units are bigger in size. Right. So uh, here's a, an example of a two bedroom unit. This is the uh, an, an example of the unit layout in our uh, two bedroom unit layout in other residences. And this one is um, a three-bedroom unit with 128 uh, with a 121 uh, square met meter uh, two bed, uh, three-bedroom unit. Um, and here are uh, different unit types in other residences. Uh, you can choose from uh, these unit areas or uh, unit types depending on the need of your family. Alright, so uh, here's the typical floor plans and unit layouts in Andaya building. Uh, this is a garden atrium building or garden atrium level. This is uh, composed of uh, 22 units per floor. This is the sky patio where uh, natural uh, light and air passes uh, through. All right, uh, this is a typical unit floor plan with uh, 24 units per floor. A typical uh, garden atrium level with 16 units per floor. Another typical floor plan with 16 units per floor. And here are uh, sample units, uh, sample two bedroom units inside other residences. Uh, this is a 67 uh, square meter um, area, uh, two bedroom unit with a 71.5 square meter area, uh, three bedroom unit that has uh, 84.5 square meters, an area of uh, 65.5, uh, 84.5, I'm sorry. Okay, so this is another three bedroom unit with a uh, 98 uh, square meter area. Uh, another three, uh, three bedroom unit with an area of 107.5 uh, square meters and um, a three bedroom unit with 121 uh, square meter area. All right, so uh, all units uh, come with a two year limited warranty and um, All right, so um, all the residences uh, bears the DMCA Homes Quality Seal, which represent our commitment to deliver homes that are built and to last. All right, so your home is subject to our proprietary quality management system and comes with a two-year limited warranty. So there you are, guys. Uh, this is the end of my presentation, and uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, you can also watch the video presentation para makita nyo po kung yan kaganda ang um, other residences na in-offer ng DMCI homes. Alright, so 
uh, please stay safe and God bless us all.